So given this information, the calculation of gamma is very simple. So now let's find the power at velocity v. And I mentioned kilograms per second. A newton is a kilogram meter per second. Dividing that by a meter per second, we get a kilogram per second. Okay? And this is the way we want to think about it. For every meter per second, I get this many newtons of force. Okay? So now, what's my power at velocity v? You've got to use a little physics. Okay? Uh, but since you guys are both in physics, we'll do that. And anybody that's looking at this who isn't, well, at least give you a formula here in a minute.